We're in the second half of this season of Big Brother Niger, Pepe Dem, and it's been back-to-back -back excitement and fun all the way through, even up till now. Hi guys, my name is Enyola Tito for OloriSupergirl.com and I'm coming to you from the Coffee Club in Lekki Phase 1. As usual, I'm not here alone. Today I'm joined by the 10th housemate to be um, evicted from the house, the one and only... And beautiful. And beautiful. <laughs> she does it to herself, but she actually is the one and only NK. NK, how are you doing? I'm good. You look awesome. Thank Red you is much. your color. Yeah, I heard. <laughs> Thank you so much. Now, NK, um, you've been out of the house for a few days now. What's been the biggest change? What has been the most surprising thing to you? Um, the most surprising thing is... Um, I, not surprising. I'm just... Okay, let me just say that I'm trying to get used to the fact that people are staring at me, that I can't walk from here to there without somebody looking at mm, me. And people pointing at yeah, yeah, so that's just what I'm trying to... And that people actually walk up to me to take pictures. Mm. So I'm just trying to get used to all those ones. <laughs> okay, so being in the Big Brother house, what was the experience like? But even before that, what getting in and going for the auditions, what was that like? What was your audition experience like? My audition experience was actually very good. Because at first we thought we were going to go in with the first set but mm -hmm. when that didn't happen obviously we forgot completely about it mm. until one day you get a call you have uh, 24 hours to get ready blah, oh, wow. blah, you just throw you into the house just like that mm -hmm. so it was a very beautiful experience i wouldn't lie i wouldn't trade it for anything and um, the house itself and the people in there is just so there's just this um Vibe. vibe in the house and mm. people outside you are just watching but us in there we, we know what's going on the actual things that are going on in the house so mm -hmm. yeah the big brother experience was beautiful it's the biggest platform i never would have thought in a million years that i would see myself in, in that, that house, house. So, yeah mm -hmm. but of course every good thing comes with well not every good thing there are some things that come with uh, like seasonal all oh, right mm. so regardless of the fact that these people love you. There are still people that, oh, it gets Well, it's not necessarily that people don't love you. It's like it's, other contestants had people that they love as well. So no, it's not, not as if. that. You can still, there are still people that love like 20 people and they just say, I don't like this person. Mm. Not, not everybody. It's a normal thing. There are people it's that life. see you. You don't have to be on TV for people to see you and say, I beg, I don't like that guy. Mm. And you actually, this person is saying it has never had a conversation with you, mm. never seen you or anything, but it's just the way it works. It seems like yeah, they are delving into, you know, uh, why you think you didn't get sufficient votes and why you got voted out. Um, let me ask you that. Why do you think, you know, you got voted out? I, that's why I, when I came out on stage, I was shocked. Like, mm. why am I here? Mm. But you can't control it. I didn't bring myself in, so I also can't keep myself in. Like, there's only so much you can do. Yeah. It's the viewers that keep you in. Mm. So, I mean, I came out. I'm like, okay, I'm out here. It doesn't matter. Mm. But I didn't know why I was out because at some point you get to find out this is why you left. So I found out. I started using my tongue to count my teeth on stage <laughs> when somebody started asking me about it. Like, why are you asking me about, about that? Me. <laughs> what has that got to do with anything? But, mm. yeah, it is what it is. Jumping on that, the whole Ludo thing, you know, um, even while you were on stage with Ibuka, people were like, it's because you spent so much time playing Ludo and this and that. So do you think that there's any truth to that? Do you think that you spent too much time playing Ludo or just not taking part in conversations with the rest of the housemates? What, in your opinion, what do you think the issue was? Now, this is the first, not taking part in conversations. Mm. I barely ever sleep. I think I started sleeping. I, I could just remember two days that I, I would say yes, I was sleeping. But yeah, I was taking um, active um, part in conversation. Yeah. There's only so much you can, you can see there. Eight, like, as, while I was there, there were 18 of us. Biggie can show you what 18 people are doing at the same time. time. So yeah. why, just because you're seeing two other people and you're not seeing me, mm. doesn't mean I'm not active. Because then when other people come out and you say, NK wasn't taking part in conversations. Okay. So what, what was the Ludo thing? <laughs> Why were people so up in the God, whole? Uh, <laughs> it's just some people that decided to take this Ludo thing from Ludo to... <laughs> to whatever. ...putting Ludo on my head. <laughs> I said, ah, wait So I cannot play Ludo in people. But uh, I just, it was when I came out, I realized, hmm. well, I can't really blame people. It's what they saw. Hmm. But then, most of them didn't bother to ask, like, uh, uh this is just two seconds of what? What about what happened before or what happened af after? Nobody cared about that part. Yeah. We were playing again, four of us. Because mm. I remember even when I, I explained this on stage, people were saying it's a lie. In my head, I'm like, I will just conjure <laughs> up Benita and Messi in the game. Because if they come out, you ask them, they can't. 
they, like they can't start lying about something that didn't happen. They, like every one of us knew what happened. Mm. So, um, Venita was the new one in the game. She didn't know how to play. Wait, yeah. Uh, Messi left, like, Messi is an OG when in it comes Ludo, to yeah. just kill, kill, kill. <laughs> then um, Cindy left. It was now me and Venita. I was like, probably like, you know that one? Yeah, before, before you, and you win. Because mm -hmm. I, 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 mean, I said, I mean, I don't win, I was about to, no, because Venita is new. I want that one let new person come Come be see. <laughs> <JJC>. So, <laughs> she had two, then she didn't know that she killed me with one. Mm. She was about to play that other, other one, then Cindy told her, no, 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 that she killed me. So that thing really just pissed me off mm. at that moment. It was that moment of me being pissed off. Mm, that that everyone was, now capitalized so now, on. Now, uh, Mercy and Venita left. Mm. Cindy was about to leave. I am brought the I started playing alone, just passing time. Mm. She came back and said, if I let's play. I said, Cindy, I'm not playing with you. Because I was just still pissed off. Yeah. So I said, I'm not playing with you. She said, why? I said, I'm not playing with you. And even the, the, the video that people saw, they didn't hear the part where Cindy was saying that she would scatter the Ludo if I say I don't want to play, play with her. her. Oh, wow. Three times, at some point, she was like, I told her, I scatter it. If you want to scatter it, that's fine. But me, I'm still not playing with you. Mm. Then she now said, I beg that I should enjoy the Ludo. You know that kind of, yeah, we are both pissed off at each other. And that was it, too. Next thing. <laughs> Next thing, NK is PSA. a bully. <clears throat> NK the narrative was, NK was playing Ludo. Cindy came to play. NK said no. NK is the bully. Cindy is the little orphan. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Which is actually, like Joe said, which is actually an insult to her because just because you saw that moment, that doesn't mean you should deduce mm, who Cindy is. You is, haven't even, yeah, from you that don't even one. know her. Yes. Mm. Interesting. Well, thanks for shedding light on that because it's been a whole issue, the thing between you and Cindy and you know, maybe Cindy playing the victim, you know, and whatnot. But uh, no, she didn't play the victim because she doesn't even know what's going on here. So mm. she didn't play any victim. Because later and she you don't think she was doing that intentionally to make it look like you were that trying is, to chance her is, or take advantage of her? That is her, her, own, her own part of the story. Because I remember she went to Joe to tell Joe that mm. she knew I was angry about the whole thing. Mm. And, you know, she knew she got me angry. Mm. But even after that whole thing, I went to the diary session. I remember, because I had even forgotten this little thing. Biggie was asking me um, about the head of house. I said I would have really loved a girl to win because all the head of house, except the I first time is. Esther won. I said I, I, I would have really loved if a girl won. When she did her task, I was the first person, me and Kathy, that jumped up to congratulate her. Like we completely forgot about the, I'm not coming on stage, I'm not hearing Ludoku. You abused Cindy. You have a condescending attitude. That, I said, but now nobody will now care to see that all the while that me and Cindy have been. And it, that we've just been completely cool. Cool, yeah. Even when she's mm -hmm. been telling Venita, thank you yeah. for that, that she was telling Venita about what I helped her with. Mm -hmm. Even when she told Biggie about me um, helping her with it. No, yeah. they now saw it. They now yeah. saw that NK is a villain and she abused Cindy. So the day I came out, I was shocked. Yeah. Because when I said I love Cindy on stage, people were like, he's a liar. I don't even know what's going on again. I have to like keep quiet. Well, yeah, I guess I guess when Cindy herself comes out, she will uh, she will corroborate your story. But we believe you, and so as far as I'm concerned, you've cleared your name. Now let's come back to you. Um, did you have a strategy when you went into the Big Brother house? My strategy was to be myself and love myself, mm. and um, not bother about who loves me, who likes me, or who doesn't. Because then when you have it in your head that this person doesn't like me. You just try and find that energy to the person. So I never bothered about who didn't like me or not. Do, do you feel like that worked against you? Because there are a lot of people in the house that are really playing to the cameras and really like kind of sucking up to each other. Mm -hmm. You know, that, so if I'm Mike's friend or if I'm Tatcha's friend, then people will keep me in the game. From, from my point of view, I, I feel like that's happening. Do you feel like if you don't form alliances and if you don't try and play to the camera that it would, you know, put you in the position that you are now? about alliances I, was, I never went in there to form any alliance and if you watched anything about that we, I, I personally just realized that because it was my friend was telling me that even I me us being out and going in we at least even though we didn't watch we already knew the ones that people loved but I didn't bother myself trying to attach to myself anyone. to anybody mm. and at the end of the day the person I even became friends like really really cool friends with was Jackie mm. and Benita so I, I I personally did not do any of it I went there to be myself mm -hmm. and I'm just going to believe that if the Ludo incident hadn't happened mm -hmm. it would have been a different story Sorry. okay cool all right so you said you were close to Jackie who else did you bond with in the house Jackie Benita mm -hmm. I don't know about bonding but the other people I were cool with Tasha Sadi and mm. Shay. 
And she, okay. And who weren't you cool with? Who didn't you, you just gel with? The people, not that I didn't gel with them. I, I was really too, in my opinion, I mm -hmm. was cool with everyone. Everyone, yeah. Everyone. Mm -hmm. But, I don't know. Mm. In these days, are you I, sure? Be careful watching. <laughs> yes, but you can be <laughs> political about it as I well. <laughs> you don't. You don't be political. I would rather pledge mm. the fifth. Okay. Well, um, there were lots of things that happened in the house while you and the other four new housemates were there. You had the fashion show. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Well, you and the other four. So oh, five okay. of you in total. Yeah. So you had the fashion show. You had the coronation, which was very beautiful. Oh, Everyone yeah, loved it. Was, it. Was yeah. Time. And there's so many. Last week, there's so many tasks. There's the Dano task. There's so many things going yeah, on. The talent show. The talent show. Of all the activities that you know you took part in in your time in the Big Brother house, which was your favorite? You guys know it's gonna be the Opal because I want money. <laughs> okay. And it was right. Too. Oh right. It for me. Oh cool, cool, cool. How much did you win? Two hundred thousand naira. Yay! And an Opal phone. Opal. Have they given you? Uh, <laughs> no, you yes. get gifts you get after, the, after show. the season. Okay. Well, congratulations, Thank congratulations. <laughs> okay. So um, now that you're out, mm. and you know, life has changed a bit. Like you said earlier, people are coming up to you and saying hello and taking mm -hmm. selfies with you and whatnot. Mm -hmm. Your following on social media has grown a bit. Yeah. Before you went in, how many followers did you have? Sixteen thousand. About sixteen thousand. Now you're on like forty thousand and something. And something, right? With this new fame and popularity, what's next for Enki? What do you what do you plan to do? Enki, as a very talented girl that she that she is, is. <laughs> you have to give her credit. Bam. <laughs> she wants to build her bridal line. Okay. She wants to finish her book because she's writing a book. Okay. She hopes mm -hmm. to go into acting because she just discovered this. Mm. She can do it. Right. Yes. <laughs> In fact, she fit enter studio scene. In fact, there's nothing I can do. Majorly, yes, no. But, mm. And but majorly, I'm honestly looking at um, doing, being an ambassador of like big brands and all those, you know, the whole influencer package. Okay. Yes. Do you have a particular preference, beauty brands or like electronics or like uh, FMCGs? You can't limit yourself. Anybody that is ready to do business should get in touch. Yep. Awesome. Um, one more question, Enki. Who, who amongst the final housemates? Would you like to win one, and who do you think will win? Those are two different see, questions. Yeah, you just actually phrase it. Right? Would I like to win? I have mm. like two people I would like to win, and they are, that's Venita and Jackie. Right. Do I think mm. would win? Mm. Anybody. <laughs> okay. Anybody can win. Okay, so the five of you that came in a few weeks into the show, do you feel like the the older housemates really accepted you guys? No, of, of, I mean, some of them did, some of them didn't, but to, I mean, I don't just hold it against them because I probably would have done same. Imagine you are playing the game, there are 14 of you, you're already counting that two people will leave this week, two people will remain And them, then all of a sudden... And then they pack five more. <laughs> Come on, it, the way they reacted was the way any human being would react. Mm. So do you think um, the remaining three who are still in there, Venita, Elo, and Cindy, do you think they have a chance of making definitely, it to the final five? Definitely, trust they do. me. <laughs> I've learned one thing in this Big Brother thing and that honestly you cannot predict, predict what yeah. will happen. Anything yeah. can happen. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right, NK, before we go, I'm going to ask you um, to give me to or to describe all the housemates. <laughs> yeah, look at me, so sure. don't worry, it's not oh, it's not this serious. I feel like pass will point <laughs> so yes. I'm gonna ask you to describe each of your former housemates in one word. Mm -hmm. Both the ones you met in the house and the ones you didn't meet. So just use one word, maximum two words to describe them. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Two words. Two words. Two words. Okay. Or max. Okay? All right. Mm -hmm. Big Brother soundtrack. Nah. <laughs> oh, the Big Brother sound. <laughs> no, the Arena Games. This is soundtrack. Okay. So, first of all, she. She. Wow. Sugar puppy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You should take his sugar daddy. That's wow. just described him. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> Isi Lomo, who you didn't meet in the house, though? Oh your guy. Oh, okay, okay. She know, she know. What do you like about Isi Lomo? Uh, Isi is blonde. Mm. She's, she's, um, she's real, right? Yeah, she's real and she's unapologetic about herself. Cool. Mercy. Mercy Lambo. Hmm. Smart. Okay. Um, Ike. Ike is actually smart. I'll use smart and numbers because he's the guy, he is so good with numbers. Oh, really? He's a mathematician. Oh, yeah. wow. Ike? Yep. Ah, okay. <laughs> Esther. Esther. Calculated. 
What was your relationship with like with Esther? At first, I, I, like Esther had, like, I keep telling her she has this default look. But when I started talking with her, I realized that it's just the look, not how she feels. Act, act, Esther actually is a very sweet person. Okay. Very sweet. Nelson. Pass. Okay. Um, Omar Shola. Pass. <laughs> okay. Kim Oprah. Didn't, you didn't meet her. Wait, now. you said Omashola. I said Omashola. Oh, Omashola. And I was like, uh, everybody loves Omashola. Omashola, loud. Loud. Not in a bad way, but. but you yeah. Know. yeah. Um, Kim Oprah? Pass. I didn't meet her. You didn't meet her. Pass. Okay. Gedoni. Hmm. Take your time. Gedoni. <laughs> I would say quiet. Quiet. Real quick about Gedoni and Kafi's situation. That is, yeah. Um, question to answer. Let's just stop it there. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, Avala. Avala. Cool. Cool. Okay. No, uh, sweet. All right. Toyo. I didn't meet him. Pass. Okay. Uh, Thelma. Thelma. Funny. Okay. Fraud. Fraud is funny, but let's leave that that. <laughs> but. It can be annoying. I remember what you said on stage, you know, when you came out and you're talking to Ibuka, yeah. You said, oh, I think I've yes. been attacked for that one too. But no, no, no. It's similar to what you just said. Right. Everybody could do all right, but and you haven't said anything too far from the truth. Fraud can be funny sometimes. Uh, Maybe that's his game. But plan. it's nothing yeah, but it's, it's something that you can never hold against him because the next second mm. you completely forget that he said something like that. Kaffee. Kaffee is uh, I don't want to use sweet. I'm trying to I Naive? Is that your, that's yours? No, I'm, I'm giving you options. She is. <laughs> I'll be sweet. Sweet. Okay. Um, happy, sweet. Tasha. Tasha. No, no, I'll use happy for... Kaffee. Kaffee, I'll use sweet for Tasha. Unpopular opinion. Unpopular opinion? Yes. Okay. I like that you, you added that. Jackie. Ah, my guy. Mm. Jackie is uh, intelligent. Mm. And beautiful. Awesome. Diane. Pass. Mike. No, not in a like if I don't know what how to. No, but you spent two weeks Diane with. Diane is also quiet anyway. Mm. Uh, yeah, how he's quiet. Okay. Mike. Mike is funny mm -hmm. and cool. Okay. Sardi. Ah, Sardi is sweet and welcoming, accommodating. Accommodating. Ella. I didn't meet her. Pass. Jeff. Ah, Jeff. Jeff is is um, <clears throat> cruise and smart. And smart. Okay. <laughs> Elozunam. Elozunam. Uh, what's the word to describe an energetic person? Bubbly, creative. Yes. I'll use bubbly. Outgoing. And um, energetic. Johnny Bravo. Johnny Bravo. <laughs> Venita. Ah, Venita is beautiful and amazing. Cindy. Cindy is uh, cool and I'll leave it at cool. Okay. And he's somewhere nearby and I know his ears will be standing up right now to hear what you say. Uh, Joe. Joe is sarcastic <laughs> and Annoying. And annoying. Yes, I said it. <laughs> cool, cool, cool. Okay, Enki, you're going to answer some questions from our social media community. We put right. your video out there. People have questions for you. But mm -hmm. you're going to answer that, those questions over some wings. Our wings are here now. And the good people, <clears throat> just grab this real quick. The good people at DSTV gave us a box of pepper sauces to celebrate. You miss Big Brother's logo, I'll be his face. <laughs> so I'm going to, they gave us the box of pepper sauces to celebrate this season, your season, pepper them. And what you're going to do for me is that you're going to close your eyes. Oh, well, I don't you have to check. Yes, you don't get to oh, check. One I don't like. That's, that is your luck. <laughs> it's an arena game. <laughs> so you close your eyes and then you pick one and use it to season your wings. So give me your hand, lift your one hand up. There we go. Uh -huh. So there you go. So you can feel round. You have plenty, so plenty. It if I feel it. I mean, yeah, I mean the, okay. So carry it. Open. Garlic, garlic sauce. I don't eat garlic. <laughs> you don't eat garlic. No. <laughs> Too bad. <laughs> you don't have allergies. It won't affect you. You won't affect your tummy. 
I don't eat garlic. I will break the rules just for you, mm -hmm. this one time. So close your eyes. <laughs> don't put the garlic sauce back home. I did not put it back. All right. So what's that one? Peri-peri sauce. Hot, what's it? Nando's. Nando's peri-peri sauce. Hot peri-peri sauce. So you want to season it on your own? Season your wings. And then please let's have the questions from social media for NK. First question is from Nasal underscore. Mm -hmm. Says, what was your reason yeah. for saying you haven't seen any artists that you pay to watch live? I'm just not a. I'm just not a concert person. Yeah, I like comedy shows. I can go on that, but concerts, I I just haven't found the interest. Who's your favorite Nigerian artist? This kid. What about female? Simi Sola. So you wouldn't pay to go for their concerts? I mean, I don't... How do I phrase this thing? Mm. If I'm going to sit in V, 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 I... Then oh. you go. <laughs> but I'm not about to stand up uh -huh. and go for those kind of shows. shows. No, it's not what I want. want. Okay. If I want to go for something, I enjoy the experience. I have never gone for a musical um, concert. Concerts. Okay. Not because the opportunities have never arrived. But mm. It's not your cup of tea. No. It's Fine. V, 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 I, P. Getting you. Next question. The okay, second question is from Timmy underscore tech. Mm. It says, do you have any feelings for Ike? No, I don't have no feelings. And I don't know why the, <coughs> this question keeps coming up. I don't have, I have a man, okay? <laughs> I ain't got no feelings for Ike. <laughs> but why, why are these questions, or why is that particular question coming up? it was after the truth or their game, and then you know, right. people just took it out of mm. proportion mm. again, so. Awesome, okay. Well, Enki, while you enjoy your wings, I just want to say thank you so much for coming on and f on our show and for t telling us about your time in the Big Brother Niger house. When you bite that, you let us know how hot it is. Is it really hot or is it just okay? It's mild. It's really hot. It's really hot. <laughs> it's actually nice. It's actually nice. Yep. There you go. You see, we're looking out for you. You don't want to fall your hand. <laughs> Enki, thanks so much for being here and we wish you all the best with your future endeavors. Um, you've said that you're going to continue with your bridal line and whatnot and yeah. perhaps acting. We'd love to see you in Hollywood. You're, you know, you're dancing with Ibo thing and my you face, know, and my face, body. Hey, Football producers, <laughs> designers, everybody. <laughs> Allah at NK. Please go. Please go. <laughs> we wish you all the best for the future and with all your future endeavors. Thank you so much for being here, NK. Thank you too. And if people want to follow you, your handle is at T H E E N K A Y official. No underscore, the NK official. The NK official. And if you want to follow Big Brother or watch the happenings in the Big Brother house, remember you can do so on DSTV channel 198 and on GoTV channel 29. And for all the happenings and the breaking news for what's happening in the Big Brother house, remember that you can catch all that on Olori Supergirls platforms as well, both the website and social media. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll catch you in the next one. I'm going to beg NK for some of her wings. I'm not giving you, Ha. <laughs>